Hello, my name is Dr Gill. I've been asked to do an examination of your cranial nerves, so the nerves that control your face and head. Would that be okay? Yeah. So to start off, could you confirm to me your name and date of birth, please? Laura Coventry, 18th of May, 95. Perfect. So to start off, we'll look at your sense of smell. Have you noticed any changes with your nose at all? No. Okay. So no blocked nose or anything like that? No. Okay. So, so if you could put a finger over one nostril and breathe in and relax, and we'll do the same again on the opposite side. Super. So I've got um, a substance here. If you close your eyes, tell me what you can smell, if anything. Coffee. Super. Okay, that confirms everything's working there. Thank you. So now we need to actually see how well you, uh, your vision is. So do you wear glasses normally? Yes. Okay, do you have them with you? I'm wearing lenses. Okay, and have you had any changes to your prescription recently? No. Okay, so if you look at my face, have I got any black splodges? Am I missing anything? No. Perfect. So what I'd like to do to start off with, behind me is a Snellen chart. Um, so could you cover your right eye for me? Okay. And what's the lowest line you can read on there? The bottom line. Could you start from the left, please? A, M, O, T. Perfect. And swap eyes. If you could put your hand over your right eye, what's the lowest line you could read? At the bottom. Okay. And start from the right side of the paper. X, V, U, W, T, O, M. -A. Perfect. So we've got no problems there. Now I'm going to shine a light in your eye. Okay, so if you could put a hand over your left eye for me, please. Okay, and then over the right eye. Okay, and relax back to normal. That's fine, thank you. So there are no problems at all with that. So I'm just going to put it over here. Okay, and swap over, the same thing. That's fine, and just one. And the next thing, if you could look at my finger, and then at the ceiling behind me, and then back to the finger. Superb. Now, in order to really get a good idea of how your eyes are working, I actually need to have a look at the back. Would that be okay? Yeah. So I'm going to shine the light directly in your eye, but I'm going to have to come quite close to do that. Okay. So I'm going to take these off. Get that to 10 where I can focus it. Okay. So if you um, just keep looking straight ahead for me. Okay, and if you could look up, please. And if you could look down. Okay, and look to the left. Okay, and look to the right. And look directly into the light. Okay, thank you. And we'll just do the opposite side. Are you okay? Okay, so we're going to do the same again. Okay, look up for me. Okay, and look down for me. And to the left. Okay, and to the right. And look directly into the light, please. That's fine. Super. Okay, so now we're going to see how well your eyes work on the very side. So we're going to look at your peripheral vision. Okay, so I'm just going to make sure I'm the right distance away. Okay, so you can see my finger waggling? Yeah. Okay. Tell me when you can see my finger waggling. Yeah. 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 That's fine. I'm just going to come across the other side. Yeah. 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 So if you could just swap eyes for me. Okay. And you can see my finger waggling? Yeah. Okay. Please stay looking in this eye and tell me when you can see my finger. Yeah. Okay, super. Right, now we need to look over how your eyes will move. So if you keep your head still for me, and I want you to follow my finger and tell me if there's any double vision at all. No. Any double vision? No. Okay. Any double vision? No. Any double vision? No. Any double vision? No. Any double vision? No. Okay. Any double vision? No. And the last point up there. Any problems with that? No. Excellent. So to finish off now, I'm going to put, I'm going to put a hand over one eye for me, okay, and I'm going to show you a pen top. Can you tell me what colour that is? Red. Okay. And if you could swap hands, and it's red. 
Okay, are they the same red on both sides? Yes. Okay, so it doesn't seem to become paler on one eye compared to the other. No. Super. Okay, now we're going to have a look for something called your blind spot. So if you could put a hand over one eye for me, okay, and I want you to only look into this eye here, and at some point as I move the pen across, the pen will disappear, or the pen top will. Mm -hmm. Okay, so if it's gone now, I'm going to carry on moving it across until when it reappears. Back. Okay, I'm going to go backwards. So gone. is it okay now? Tell when it reappears. Back. Okay, so um, okay, I'm going to go up now. Back. Okay, and then down. Gone. Super. Okay, and last one comes back. Back. Excellent. So we swap over to the other eye for me. Again, looking into my eye here. So tell me when it disappears. Gone. Okay, tell me when it reappears. Back. Okay, and tell me when it disappears. Gone. Back. Okay, right, I'm now going up. Back. Okay, and tell me when it disappears. Excellent. So your blind spot lines up well with mine there, um, but thank you, I appreciate that's a slightly difficult test to do. Now we're going to look at the, your sense of sensation on your face. Mm -hmm. So I've got a little point here, but it is bluntened. If I could have a finger. Okay. So you can see you can feel it, but it isn't sharp. Yeah. Okay. If you close your eyes and tell me when you feel it. Yep. 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 Terrific. Okay, and um, now we're going to see um, what the sensation on your eyes are like. Okay, so I've got a bit of cotton wool, and if you could look all the way to that side for me, and I'm just going to bring this in from the side, I'm just going to touch the side of your eye. That's fine. And we're going to do the same if you could look over that way. I'm just going to come in from the side and then just touch it. Okay, super, thank you very much. Now, I'd like to tap on your forehead, just relax for me. Okay, so we've got a nice blink there, that's good. And finally, if you could try and relax your jaw for me. I'm just going to tap over your jaw. Okay, now we're going to have a quick look at the muscles that control your face. So if you could raise your eyebrows up as high as you can, please. Super. And screw your eyes tight. Now don't let me open. That's good. If you could show me your teeth. Okay, and blow your cheeks out for me. Super. Now we're going to have a look over your hearing. Have you noticed any problems with your hearing? No. Good. So we're going to start off, if you could just rub the front of your ear, please. And I'm going to say a word, and I'd like you to repeat it back to me, please. 100. 100. Okay, and if we could swap over for me. 99. 99. Excellent. So we know that everything seems to be working well. The next thing we're going to do, I'm going to get this tuning fork. We're going to strike it, and I'll put it in your forehead. Okay. And we're just going to do the same again. So I'm just going to put this on your forehead. And tell me if you can where well, you can hear the noise. Is it left, right, or middle? Middle. Okay, super. So we need to do an additional test on that, which will involve putting this on the bone behind your ear. When the sound stops, please tell me, and I'm going to move it round, and I want to see if you can hear it then. Okay. I'm going to need to come round the back in order to do that. And tell me when you can't hear the noise anymore. And can you hear it now? Yes. Excellent. We'll do the same on this side. Okay. You can hear the noise? Yes. Okay, tell me when you can't. Gone. Can you hear it there? Yes. Excellent. Okay. Now we need to have a look in your mouth. If you'd like to take a sip of water. And just swallow it, please. Okay. Any problems there? No. At home, do you have any problems with eating or drinking? No. Okay, so no coughing afterwards. No. Excellent. So what we'd like to do now is I'm just going to have a look in the back of your mouth. So if you could open wide, please. And a nice long R, please. Uh. Superb. Okay. 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 So I'm just going to test the powers now of the muscles in your head and neck. So I'm going to put my hand to the side of your face. And if you could push. Super. And we'll do the same on the other side. So push, push, push. Excellent. Now I'm going to put my arms on your shoulders and push up for me. Okay, that's excellent. Now the final bit, if you could stick your tongue out for me, please. Okay, and there's no problems there. And put the tongue to the side of your mouth. And I'm going to push back. And on the other side, please. I know we've been having a reasonable conversation throughout, but if you could just finish off by saying A-E-I-O-N-U, please. A-E-I-O-U. 
Excellent. So we've had no problems with your cranial nerves, so we can give you a clean bill of health on that. Do you have any questions for me? No. Super. Thank you very much for your time.